Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Jessica J. If you're new here, I do home decor videos, lifestyle videos, and shop with me. So if that interests you in any way, please consider subscribing. So in today's video, we are going to CB2 and we're gonna pop into Crate and Barrel as well. They both came out with new items and I was dying to get in there, you guys, to see these pieces in person. So I'm gonna take you guys with me to see these new items. We're gonna come back and I'm gonna give a little review on what I think on some of the pieces that I've been having my eye on. So if you guys are excited for the Shop With Me Experience haul and a little review, please give the video a thumbs up. It does help my channel out and let's get started.
we're back. So I want to highlight some of the items that I did show, some of the items that I absolutely love. You know, I have my eye on a few of these pieces. So I want to give you guys a little review since I physically saw it in the store. I have my computer here, so I'm going to be looking back and forth. Hopefully you guys don't mind. But the first item I want to highlight is the Mood Lighting Black Candlestick. You guys, I love this candle. So you guys know how I feel about my black accents and interesting shapes. I love marble. I mean, what's, what is there to hate about this item? It is a little on the pricier side for one. I wish it was a set of two for $99, but you guys, this item is so beautiful. If you are interested in this item, it is actually ready to ship. So it's not on back order or anything like that. So these items were really substantial in weight and they are really, really beautiful. The only reason why I didn't pick them up right away was because, well, one, now they're more on the pricier side, but I was thinking about putting them here behind me on my sideboard. And if you guys seen the sideboard, the bottom half, which are the cabinets, they have a hexagon shape on them. And I felt like maybe the shaping or the geometric shapes of the candlestick and of my sideboard will kind of clash. But other than that, I think they're amazing. If I have an opportunity to put these somewhere else, once I finish up with my living room, you guys will see those in my home. <laughs> okay, another item that I want to talk about, and I actually have my eye on this item, is the Nadia Black Cane Chair. This chair is beautiful, you guys. It has a cane backing, and then the seat is made with a boucle fabric. And I mean, they're gorgeous. They're absolutely beautiful. I did sit in it and I will say, it's not the most comfortable chair that you can sit in for hours, but I still think they are a beautiful chair. I'm actually interested in the bar stool version of this chair. I feel like with bar stools, you can get away with not having the most comfortable bar stool with the you know most plush backing and everything like that. Let me know if you guys agree. But the beauty is there and I wish they had the bar stool so I could test that out because I'm really, really interested in that item. I think this item would look so amazing in a modern or a boho home. And I do really love how natural materials can bring in that warmth. So I have my eye on the bar stool for sure. Okay, the next item I wanna talk about is the Lisette white dining chair. I mean, come on, you guys, this chair is so beautiful. They also have in the bar stool, which is not my favorite. I actually like it in the dining chair a lot more. My only issue with this item is it's a very low back. So like I said, sitting at your dining table for hours on end, mm, I can't really see it. So having gatherings and you know, you invite your parents over or friends and family, I just don't see them being comfortable sitting in this chair on end, but you guys, it is a beautiful, beautiful chair. And trust me, I've thought about it over and over again. I'm actually trying to find something very similar that I can use with a higher back and something a little bit more comfortable, but it's a beautiful chair. And these are actually on back order until August. And the fabric is a performance fabric, which means that it is stained and um, water resistant, which is amazing. We need those, especially at the dining table. Okay, the next item I want to highlight are these tuxedo pillows. And these are actually by Caraman. They came out with the Caraman collection. And I love these. You guys know I'm gonna love these. <laughs> but I just really love how the pillows are a linen fabric and then the border of it is a leather. I don't know, I just really gravitate towards items that are a little bit different, a little bit edgy and these are it without being too much and i think this would be perfect to layer with other pillows they're just amazing you can get them in a down alternative or you can get them in the feather fill okay now for the haul i'm actually really excited about these pieces the first item i want to talk about is this carafe this item actually holds 30 ounces and that is amazing and let me tell you guys why I haven't been the best with drinking water lately, and this item has encouraged me to drink more water. So basically I keep this on my kitchen counter and I just 
fill my glass of water up and I will drink out of this all day. And I keep track of how many times I fill this up and drink the water. I really like having this on my counter. It's so aesthetically pleasing. It's beautiful and simple. So I like having this on my counter and I'm gonna put this down because you guys are here. I'm like a little clink, clink, clink. Um, I like having that on my counter. It looks beautiful and it almost looks like a decor piece. So I love getting items that are beautiful. I can leave out, but also functional. I'm really big on things being functional. I know a lot of people who keep this on their bedside table and they usually fill it up and keep the top on. Usually the tops are made with a glass as well, but they leave this on their nightstand so that if they wake up in the middle of the night, or if they get thirsty, they can pour themselves a glass of water and I have to get out of bed. Um, and they don't have to worry about dust getting in their water. I don't know about you guys, but if you ever poured yourself a glass of water, put it on your nightstand and then wake up in the morning, there's usually dust particles in that water if you look closely, which is kind of disgusting. So this kind of keeps that from happening. Okay, the next item I picked up is this beautiful vase right here and i kind of have a floral arrangement going on in here um, i actually went to the la flower market which if you guys are in the area please go to the la flower market it's amazing they pretty much have anything that you could ever want there it's humongous so be prepared to spend a little bit of time there i did go shopping to a couple other places after i picked up my flowers so a few of them didn't make it in this vase right here but Let's focus on the vase. So this is their tear shiny white vase and it's a stoneware vase. This is watertight. I can just fill this up with water, throw any live beautiful arrangement I decide to put in it and I'm good to go. So this item retails for $14.95, which is an amazing price. But I just love the refreshed look of it with the new season. Okay, next item I picked up are these glass straws. I picked up a set of four and i actually have straws i think i showed you guys them if you've been following me for a while i picked up these from amazon i'm drinking the energy drink my neighbor gave me but i picked up these glass straws from amazon and they're great for smoothies or maybe something like this but in a normal glass it just looked kind of silly so i picked up some smaller ones and you guys can see the size comparison between the two these were only a dollar fifty they do come in a set of i believe eight for nine dollars one sold for nine dollars but i just like the fact that they're glass they're clear so i can see in them to make sure you know they're clean and i just you know love the way they look i don't know i'm just ready for like the warmer weather sitting back drinking some lemonade it's about the vibes you guys it's about the vibes okay and the last item i got i actually don't physically have it here with me right now i did take a video of it before returning it and i will tell you guys why i return it in just a second but it's the milli glass beverage dispenser it's this beautiful old-fashioned um crystal looking glass dispenser and guys i've been having my eye on this since i saw it on their in their catalog on their website and every time i see it i'm like i have to have that i have to have that and i went into the store and i did not expect to see it on display and i saw it i said you are coming home with me this item is actually on back order until early august and they had the display available the associate told me that he would give me a discount if i decided to take the floor model and i was all for it. i told him yes took the discount and went on my merry way so i kind of regret not inspecting it more because it is a floor model and it's glass and there were a few chips in the glass and not only that i wasn't really happy with the quality and especially because guys this item is it retails for $79.95. I just wasn't thrilled about the quality. So I don't know if it was because it was a floor model and maybe it was dinged up. And honestly, I would order this again in a heartbeat just to get a brand new one because I love it that much. But it's on back order until August, you guys. So, you know, I would have loved to have it for the summer and you know, put all kinds of delicious drinks in there, which there are plenty of opportunities to use this and display it um, after summer, but I don't know. I think it's still very beautiful and I still want it, but I have not placed my order and I don't know if I will because I don't know if I want to wait till August. All right guys, so that is the haul and my review on some of the items that I wanted to highlight. Let me know what you guys have your eye on. I love CB2, so I'm always interested in what they have going on. So share what you guys like from the website and what you might be getting. And as always, please give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.